Graphene Oxide Detox, Unveiling the Methods Hello and welcome to this video about removing graphene oxide from organs and tissues in the human body. We'll explore the methods that have shown promise in tackling this intriguing challenge. Graphene Oxide, a derivative of graphene, is known for its unique properties, which have led to widespread interest in various fields. However, like any other foreign substance, its accumulation in the body could pose potential risks. Let's dive in. What is graphene oxide and how does it get into our body? Graphene oxide is a single atomic layered material, consisting of carbon, oxygen, and hydrogen. Its unique properties have made it useful in a variety of applications, including medicine, electronics, and energy. However, its presence in the body can arise from certain medical treatments, environmental exposure, or ingestion of contaminated food or water. How does graphene oxide affect our body? Although graphene oxide has shown promise in many biomedical applications, its potential toxicity and health risks are a concern. Studies have shown that high concentrations of graphene oxide can cause damage to cells and tissues, and chronic exposure may lead to inflammation and oxidative stress. Understanding the ways graphene oxide can affect our body is a key part of developing effective removal methods. How can we remove graphene oxide from the body? As of my knowledge cutoff in September 2021, research on the specific methods for removing graphene oxide from different organs and tissues in the human body is ongoing and conclusive data is not yet available. However, scientists have been exploring a few potential strategies, including 1. Antioxidant therapy. Since graphene oxide can induce oxidative stress, antioxidants might be able to alleviate some of its harmful effects. Compounds like glutathione, vitamin C, and vitamin E, which can neutralize harmful free radicals, may potentially help in this regard. 2. Chelation therapy. This method involves introducing a chelating agent that binds to the graphene oxide, forming a complex that can be excreted from the body. 3. Nanotechnology-based approaches. Researchers are investigating the use of nanoparticles to encapsulate and remove graphene oxide from the body. Please note that these methods are still being studied and have not yet been proven fully effective or safe for use in humans. Consultation with a healthcare professional is necessary before attempting any kind of detoxification regimen. That wraps up our discussion on the methods for removing graphene oxide from different organs and tissues in the body. Keep in mind, this is a rapidly evolving field of research and new findings could emerge at any time. Please consult with your healthcare provider for any concerns related to graphene oxide in your body. As always, remember that prevention is the best cure. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for more intriguing health and science discussions.